Well, I guess I should have had some shares on the media coverage. Uh, unfortunately, I didn't. But uh, no, it's certainly great to see the interest that I have seen already in summer and now again because it, uh, it shows that, that people still believe in myself and that is uh, naturally a great thing. It's inspiring for what uh, we're going to do in future. It's a funny story because I had a chat with uh, Ross in Abu Dhabi concerning sort of half serious question if I would consider driving again and uh, it wasn't the right moment. I wasn't really considering since three years though three weeks later he called me again and he, he put the question a little bit more serious and I don't know what happened but uh, the fact working together with Ross having the combination together with Mercedes GP and Petronas to go back on track, uh, it was inspiring. It was something that, that uh, sparked inside myself and until now has never stopped. And it's really uh, something that, that makes, my, makes myself uh, thrilled. The point that, that Mercedes actually uh, paid a ticket for me into Formula One and now I'm able to return back to Mercedes and hopefully give back what they wish for, and that is uh, uh, to come back and, and win races together with uh, Mercedes GP. It's something that, that I really look forward to. I guess golden times in the Silver Arrow, you should uh, name it, and it's something that uh, we have a good chance. If you look at where the car has been last year and the team, if you look with the support, with the more intense support Mercedes uh, uh, will obviously uh, give to the team and now having a new partner with Petronas on the side. So it's a package that sounds very promising. It sounds uh, inspiring for myself to, to grab the wheel and I can't wait for it. Not at all. In summer, unfortunately we have to say uh, the time was too early. The time between the accident and driving back in a Formula One car it was too small. Now we have almost a year and uh, I have now started obviously intense training and I'm already at levels that I have not been able to, to work at in summertime so I have no doubt about my neck. Well it's, it's a funny story because uh, uh, just recently we saw each other at the go-kart track. I arrived at the airport and uh, who I see, it was Nico waiting for a taxi. So we put him in our car and, and go together to the racetrack. At this time we didn't know there was uh, actually a, a possible uh, joining with each other. And I think he's highly competitive, he's very fast, he has proven this uh, many times, but at the same time that's a big challenge for me.